Now, have you ever heard of a five minute long action movie? No, I haven't either. They're usually a couple of hours long, aren't they? But apparently, a five minute action movie has been filmed in Jersey by a local film company. It's to promote some smartphone apps and cyber digital systems in Jersey is behind it. So let's hear more about it. Fred Mayer from the company is with us now. Fred, good morning. Good morning. A five-minute action film is quite a challenge. Um, yeah. What, how did you go about it? Well, we um, we obviously started with um, with a small script in order to promote the smartphone app, and then from then we went on to a secret mission, and then uh, and then, then just decided to just uh, pack all up in five minutes to 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 make it really obviously you know quick but um, interesting. So a smartphone app is a, a, a tool that you can use on your smartphone to do a, whatever it might be, and you're promoting that. So how are you trying to get the message across in your film? Well, the two smartphone apps essentially are really Jersey, dedicated Jersey apps. They are for Jersey. They promote Jerseys in many ways. Um, so we thought, well, the film has to be about Jersey. So we're using Jersey location. We're, using, we're showcasing Jersey businesses. We're showcasing uh, the beautiful location we have in Jersey, uh, wrapping all this up in an action movie with a mission behind. Whereabouts in Jersey have you been then? Uh, Pretty much everywhere, from from literally St. Bernard, St. Antoine, and obviously all the town shots, the King Street shots. Uh, so, yeah, pretty much everywhere. Are you allowed to tell us a bit about the plot of your movie? Um, basically, it's a mission. It's Leonie's mission. Um, what it is, is there's a code. Um, and if people can crack the code, which is revealed in the mission, in the full, in movie, uh, then they'll be up for a really good prize, a really, really good prize. That sounds like fun. Um, action movies aren't always easy to do, though, because they need... Um, very fast camera work, they need special effects, they need stuntmen and all that sort of things. How did you go about finding them here in Jersey? Well, we've got some um, skydiving shots, so that we've got some brilliant filming uh, from uh, from obviously above Jersey. Uh, and then we got we used a local company called Fortress Silent Films, which was absolutely fantastic to actually bring that up together. Uh, and although, yeah, it's only five minutes, they certainly keep you on your seat for five minutes watching. What about actors then? Where did you find them? Um, again, local actors mainly. Um, we've used um, also there's um, Mr. Sean Arnold uh, from Bergerac, uh, who's uh, do your guest appearance. Um, and then after that, we use a couple of local actors and obviously uh, uh, anybody else around as a figurant. So are there fights, shootouts, car chases, things like that? Not so much of that, no, no. But uh, there's still some uh, some interesting action, some chases a bit, yeah. So how do we find this film if you want to watch it? It's all online. Um, as from lunchtime today, we've got a website on leonismission.com um, and it's also uh, available on YouTube as well as from lunchtime today. I was just going to look it up then and watch it now, but I'm obviously too early, aren't I? Just a little bit too early. It'll be actually <laughs> live uh, as from lunchtime, yes. Spell the, spell the name out for me, Leonie's Mission. Leonie's Mission, L-E-O-N-I-E-M-I-S-S-I-O-N.com. Leonie's mission. OK, well, I'm looking forward to seeing this, um, especially to see if I recognise anybody that's in the <laughs> film. Um, did you have any particular challenges when you were producing this? Was there anything you thought, oh, that's going to be really difficult to do? Um, yes and no. I mean, obviously, um, the weather was an interesting one because we got some uh, sea scene, obviously, filming uh, underwater and actually uh, sea, sea scenes as well. And uh, Leonie's had to film, obviously, in the September Sea, which is not... Uh, the warmest tea around. Um, so that was an interesting time. Uh, there's obviously quite, um, quite a few times where it had to be obviously um, several scenes shot because it didn't work out the first time. So, so all, all, all in all, although it was a five minutes film, it took about a month and a half to, to shoot. A month and a half for five minutes. That's <laughs> yeah. a long, long time, isn't it? And was most of that um, shooting spent, uh, was most of that time rather spent in production afterwards when you finish shooting or was it spent in the shooting itself? No, it was about a month and a half shooting, uh, although obviously not every day, but uh, in real time. But then it was about, about three weeks of production afterwards as well. People still debate whether Jersey is a good place to be making films. What are your thoughts on that? Oh, I definitely think it is a good place. There are so much varieties in terms of uh, landscape, but as well as obviously of uh, uh, what we can offer in terms of um, uh, local artists, local talents. And uh, I mean, like w literally what we packed in our film with, from skydiving shoot to, to underwater scenes, it was all actually really done in Jersey, really. So there is, there is a lot of poten potential there. I'm looking forward to seeing it. I'll have to wait till lunchtime, though, like everybody else. Leonie's mission, um, it will be available from this lunchtime. Thank you very much for talking to us this morning. Pleasure. Um, that's uh, Fred Mayer from the company, which has just produced this five-minute short film uh, to advertise a um, 
smartphone app. If you want to have a look, it's Leonie's mission, but it's not going to be available until lunchtime. If I fell in love with you, would you promise to be true?